Greetings, everyone, and welcome back to Old World Blues. I'm your host, Mr. Mokalov, and right now, it is January 6, 2280, in which Tlaloc is dead, and Moctezuma fractures. Very nice. Tlaloc's death is near. It's already happened. But I've already gone ahead and done the Tepic Development Commission. Encouraged by Imperial Reform, the people of Tepic take it upon themselves to protect the Empire. Right now, we will go for paying for the cup because last time I tried to do this, but I didn't realize I had to keep 50 political power the entire time, or I forgot. So we haven't forgotten about the Baron's conduct in the war for gold and turquoise. Which will probably be a good thing, even though I might just be justifying on them, even though I'm guaranteeing their independence. Why? Well, because we thought about it again, and their independence is cool and all, but... Nah, nah. If they don't want to be with us, then we'll force them to be with us. Which sounds kind of abusive, but you know what? We're not here to play games, even though this is a game. Hey, regardless, hope you guys are having a good day. Uh, one of the comments from yesterday said I should, my, we should have our leader actually become a field marshal instead of just a general. So now we have commanding officer Rafael Kualtli. Yes, yes, very much so. Uh, right now, let's go ahead and spend a little bit of political power, but not too much. Not too much political power. Actually, how much money are we making right now? 12 is not bad. I would like Costa Caffeinata as well, uh, just because I believe that is a trade node, right? Yes. O Ozaka. 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 Yeah, cool. So, Zochicalco. Can we trade? Actually, we could have traded before. Let's double check this. That is worth 89. Monterey. I love Monterey. Like the cheese. Is that where the cheese is from? Monterey cheese? Anyways, 21.64. Not bad, not bad. Well, finalize operative education. Why not? We might as well, right? Cool. And we're gonna finish, finish that stuff. Ooh, which one do we want? Uh, laser weaponry. I think we... Let's go with Recon Kits. That'd probably be very, very good for us right now. And Mojave Territory is good. We're on the Fiends. And as you can tell, Petro Chico's dying to... Santa Ana, El Jusito Mexicano. Even the last time, we actually got married. We got hitched. And we're maybe not necessarily happier for it, but hey, at least we got friends and allies, which in this upcoming war, I'm not going to call our allies into it, just because I want them for ourselves. That's really why I want them, so. I want them to be with us no matter what. Even though we might have a little bit of a hole here, which probably wouldn't be very good. We got some of that. That's a little bit ahead of time. Let's see, engineering. Ah, research speed. Don't mind if we do. We have elite breakthrough tactics. And actually, are we done with our land auction? No, we should probably continue doing our land auction then. Rapid deployment is, of course, next. And paying for the cup is almost done. We've got 10 days left, which is cool. The University of Urapan. Cool. Under the Eagle's Wing. Maybe we'll do Fighting the Children of a God. Nah, let's do Under the Eagle's Wing. That sounds a little bit more fun. With the Jaguar's Cult broken, the time is to decide what to do with its surviving members. Because I definitely want to get down to the splendor of the Eagle eventually. Decision for the Republic of the Rio Grande's core territories. Los Ejocito Mexicano's core territories, as well as the Free Fighters. So, paying or tap. The Bear may, may regret his conduct in the war for the gold and the turquoise crown, but what's he done is done. How should we honor him for his kind acts? Punish him for his treachery? Oh! I wasted political power trying to just... Okay. Um. Well, that was a waste then. It says you guys can win. Can you guys actually win? You might actually be able to win by yourself. Can we actually all completely win here? Maybe. I don't want to call anyone else in because I want to take all the territory myself because I'm not greedy. I'm just trying to get what we think we deserve. So let's do that. Maybe get a little bit more forces down here. You know, you never know. You guys are going to get attacked. I want you, at least one of you guys, to help support the attack while your ground force is here. Because you should do relatively okay and well. We're not doing great down here, but that's okay. These guys will push through, which would be nice. Oh, and they declare war on... Oh, they want to go to war with Petra Chico. I kind of want Petra Chico for myself, but it is what it is. That's okay. Um, uh, Chichen Itza... Honey, um, I'm not sure if that's a really good idea. I, I don't know if I can support you in that war, but hey, if you if they, if they go to war with you, uh, I don't think I'll support you in that war, Chichen Itza. So hey, if it ha whatever happens, happens, and we wish you the best and we support your every move. But if you die, it's not our fault, especially if we don't come in. And I want to save up some of the political powers so we can court some of this territory. Actually, yeah, I would like to do some of that. Chief of the Navy, Ferry Captain, eh, that seems all right. Uh, put some more divisions down here. That'd be very good. Ah, we broke through. Nice. How many men have we lost? 300 versus 1,000. Not bad. Not great. Could be a little better. And you all, don't worry about moving. There you go. Help them out. Why not? Help them out. We could definitely use that trade note, though. Uh, Matthew Morgan. Anything here? Strong back? Not bad. Not great. Not really going to use them, then. We have, currently have 1.22 political power, which means we can utilize our air force, but nah. Going to get 12 caps. 
Uh, we could use more stability. Let's do that one. Thank you. War measures, see some patriotism. War propaganda is usually pretty good. We'll do that one as well. And manual prospectors. And I'll provide some power armor to scavengers because we can. Not bad. Oh, could you guys help out here maybe? And there's quite a few divisions, I would say, too, so. We'll see what happens. And can you guys help out here, actually? No. Alright, so then we'll do it like this. There you go, though. That's a little bit better. And they're actually pushing in fairly decently, so we'll just keep going on for now. Some areas are doing better, obviously, than others, so it is what it is. Go on in there. We've lost about 700 versus 1,600. Not great. Not super ideal, but... Uh, oh, there goes Petrico. How long? Oh, we still got quite a ways to go. That is not ideal. How can you guys not win? If that's the case, just stop the attacks. Just go ahead and hold. And you guys stop and hold as well, because right now I'm going to reform us right here. Game, please stop lagging like that. I might just need a new mouse. Oh, uh, we might do boom boom. So we can circle these guys and kill them all. Be a little bit more smart about that, right? Alright, modern plane attackers, caravan guards, no thank you. Wasteland pacification, there we go. Uh, that's fine for now. Don't forget the doggies. That's uh, right, engine advancements, sure enough. Let them attack us. Economic resurgence is great news. Now we get 43, which is pretty good. Pretty darn good, actually. At the same time, uh, oh, the new Apex Predator. Although the Jaguar cult has been broken, something could be salvaged from it. We could make an example out of them for the rest of the Empire, or perhaps we could grant the survivors a diminished role in our army. The only thing these scum are good for our peanut battalions. Oh, more manpower, stability, more support. Sign us up. And then, uh, fighting the children of a god. Tlaloc's so children threaten all of Mexico with robot armies. The eagle will concentrate the Empire's finest minds in a way to defeat them, including eldritch tools such as armor-piercing rockets and landmines. I like that idea. No, sir, you are not allowed to lose. You can head down here, though, because you have enough experience to do this. If that's the case, you guys are going to head straight through there and beat the snot out of their booties. Which, it sounds disgusting because snot should not be coming out of your booty, but whatever. Oh, I left a hole here, too. God dang it. Um, keep these guys in place. Actually, you just attack here, then. Because this is okay if we have our special forces just kind of doing whatever they need to do to come down here. You hold, for realsies. And you hold there. Actually, you know what? You're going to attack them. Don't let them move. You guys should do relatively okay. You help support the attack. And you are doing what? Rats? I don't like reading about rats. Rats are disgusting sometimes. Quite disgusting. Come on. Get down there. You should have more than enough time. A knight and Yucatan. Yungo moved quietly through the town's streets. He had met his contact and given him his orders. All that was left to, was to leave town, and the sooner the better. Lost in thought, he walked confidently down a smaller street. The trick was, of course, to act confident. A guard might harass a suspicious-looking man slinking through the town in the dead of night. A proud marching man, however, would attract only respect in the tip of a hat. The sideway alley he had chosen brought him close to the slave pens. A mistake. Senor, senor, a slave shouted from one of his cages. He was gesturing wildly, looking for any spare crumbs. Jungo sped up, turning his walk into a brisk pace. He had just barely managed to turn the corner when he heard a guard exit the nearby barracks and made his way over to the slave. Quietly releasing his breath, he slowed down his walk again. The less attention, the better. A close call, for sure. Wait, what the heck? Game? Did you just... I clicked on this thing, but the game chose not to. Alright. Alright then, game. I see what you're up to. It doesn't matter, because we're doing okay here now. So you guys do that. And I want you guys to... Uh, maybe not force it to attack. What are you doing? How about you hold, son? There you go, that's okay. Because we're going to have these guys move up this way now. Let's go here. Beat them up. And you know what? Force the attacks is I don't want these guys to take too much territory of our own, so. Let them die. Let them D-I-E. Oh, and you guys can just kind of hold for now. And they are doing for last end. Maybe not, maybe, maybe they're not. But still, it looks like they were, and it's getting a little annoying, so there you go. Good, push them out, and then go right here. I know to fight over the river to go to this side, which really, really, really sucks. Good, and then go here, and then we'll form up a new little line there, which we got nice. Good and nice. Uh, you guys keep these guys in place immediately. Make sure they don't move too much. Break through, break through, come on, go, go, go. Broken masks, goodbye masks. Force it, force it, we've got to get over that river. Because right now we're up to two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten divisions over here. 
in which our special forces shall do a great job under Fraga. Oh, they are doing quite well, I would say. Recon team kits, very good. Let's grab some basic fibers, ballistic fibers, I should really say. A little bit of lag, and we are... Come on, are we there yet? Never there, cool. Hold. And unleash a prejudice that should, might, or could be considered illegal. Anything else? Oh, yeah. Sorry to see this one. Thank you. Let's go, 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 boys and girls. Do not let them move. Do not let them live. Do not let them do anything worthwhile. So after that, we'll probably go to war with maybe the Vice Royalty, perhaps? That sounds, seems kind of fun. Oh, and we have, of course, the leader here. Go with the local leader. I think that'd be okay. Oh, where are their divisions at? Nope, do not let them move. Do not let them leave. We've caught them. We have them. We're going to have them forever and ever. Beautiful. Miniaturized Secretary, sign us up for some long-range radio as well. You guys have done a fantastic job. We gave it a good old Rambler try, and it well, succeeded overall. Fraga. Gunslinger, not infantry, so technically that would not be kind of worthless. Do you have any recon? Yes, we do. Yeah, 6.9. Nice. How about some more? Beautiful, my friends. We've killed off how many versus 1,000? 6,000. 6,100 versus 1,200. Not bad. And the real home of Mexico. Moctezuma sees the Aztlan Empire as a perversion of, perversion of the Aztecs. He doesn't get that. The word of the era of Mexico's progress since his day, and among those signs of progress, EMP grenades. Aw, oh, yeah. There you go, son. All right, boys and girls, let's get ready. Well, uh, well, it's time to go then. I was going to do more stuff, but all right. I'm not giving them anything since they are already took out Puerto Chico, so I'm taking this all for myself. So I don't, I, I really don't care what he wants, what they want over there. So you've got to force the attack. Uh, I said go this way. Yep, it looks like they're definitely doing some last stand in some areas here, so that kind of sucks. Um, yeah, fuel injection, why not? Guys, how have you not won yet? Let's get going. Come on. Are you guys 20 combat with or 10 combat with? You feel like you're 10 combat with, but you're not. I'm not giving them any territory because we're fighting the entire army here, so. Uh, it does not matter to me. Yep, they're definitely doing a last stand. Let's take a look. Let's see your organization. That one's barely dropping. Yep, that one didn't drop at all. Uh, Trades from Wife, if you'd like to read about this, go right ahead. Uh, war support would be nice, but I per kind of prefer stability, but let's do War support, I suppose, for this time. we got a lot of political power. So we can core stuff. Come on. Seriously, come on. Yeah. Last stand. AI. It's, it's smart for the AI to do it when they're completely encircled and they can't move at all. So it actually makes a lot of sense for them to do it, but... Look at, oh, they're gone. Drop their organization. Drop it, drop it, drop it, drop it. I want you all to come right here. Right now. We don't have time to waste. We got plenty of manpower where we're headed, so rapid deployment. Uh, that'd be nice. I always do this one, though, because 10% of our breakthroughs just, it's just so good. So we've lost about 2,000. No, not yet. So, like I said, I'm going to take all of this because they don't deserve any of it. They got it easy. Besides, they took all part of Petro Chico, so thank you. Not bad, not bad. Actually, we can go and do this too. I say our battalions just because. I think that'll be worth it. There we go. And let's go and start justifying on the Vice Royalty, perhaps. Maybe have a good time with them. Even though we should probably go to war with uh, Moctezuma himself. That child of destruction. So we'll do boomerinos, boomerinos. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. You guys, come on down to here-ish. Uh, never mind, that's Moctezuma's lands. You guys come over here. You all come over to here. I'll split you in two. Because we need soldiers over right there. Oh, goodness gracious. I only go to war if we get declared war upon, so. I don't really feel like fighting him. And then the splendor of the eagle. It's time for all of Mexico to know the eagles, the Atzlani's splendor. In that order. Yeah, no, I'm not interested, man. I'm really not interested in taking out uh, Santa Ana right now. Oh, maybe actually I am. 
Seeing how he's in a war up there by himself, too. Isn't that a bad idea, actually? Eh. Hmm. I suppose we could help out a little bit. Yeah, he overran a couple of divisions. He's not. That's not too bad for them. Yeah, it wouldn't be too bad. You know what? We can give him that part of Mexico. Well, we take the rest. Maybe that'll be okay. I think that'd be a fair trade if we join the war then. You can have all Santa Ana's territories while I will literally take everything else. I think that is a fair trade. I'm not going to commit any divisions. But, you know, whatever. Recruit from the upper echelons. Uh, sure. That doesn't seem too bad. Anything else around here? Let's do that one. Let's do that one. Study foreign wars. New army chief. Okay, not bad. I kind of like retrofit the agency. That's not bad. I like that one. And use their naval power? Sure, why not? 54 is not bad. New citizen secure package. And we got the money for it. Why not? This is going to come bite us back in the butt, isn't it? Mm, it definitely will. Alright, so you should be getting quite a bit of political power. Or not political power, but compliance here. Point 0.8 goes up to point three. Wow, that's a lot. Nice, I love it. Seems like they're still winning around here. Do we need to have any extra spare planes we could muster? No. We've got long-range radio, which is nice. Side channel attack. Very good, very good. Oh, crap. They are detecting into our lands. God dang it, you piece of the garbage. Uh, they might still win here. Yeah, these guys are slowly winning, so that's all right. We've still got... We're only halfway through to this, which is, you know, it's okay. It is what it is. Fuel injection is nice. Let's grab some defense for this one. And continue working on our land auction, of course, as well. Uh, you know what? I guess we'll send one thing of planes over. That's it should be fine to send them over. Let's see, where are they? Well, honestly, even if I wanted to, there's no real good air bases around there. But the Splendor of the Eagle's done. That's kind of nice. Let's do weapons of Europan. The guilds of Europan are quite capable of running the city. With only some encouragement, we can found an Imperial University to promote the higher learning from before the war. And get another civilian factory and a few more blueprints. Just sign us up. I like that a lot. Anything else around here? Nah, we're still working on stuff. Demand a rifle territories. Uh, we don't really have con any connection there or even up north, so I'm gonna. Oh. Well, this one doesn't even matter. So I'm not even gonna bother with that for now then. Anything else? Not really, no. Hmm. Consumer goods. Weekly stability. Might as well. Twice into a lot. Oh. Nice. Pulls cold modifications. Sign us up. Yeah, I mean, I could get involved, but I don't really want to, I'll be honest, man. I really don't care about it too much. But what I do care about is building up our industry. And taking more territory and, and making things a little better for everyone here. There you go. Army Department, Air Force Department. Actually, we'll take one of you all to do what? Counterintelligence that use you then. I'll put down some resistance, how about that? There you go. And then, looks like we had some upgrades around here. Oh, you know, the university's done it. Wow, that's, that's kind of fast. Tough leader's not too bad, maybe. Cunning leader. Love leader. Tough leader. Oh, I kind of actually like that one a lot. Uh, fortunate leader. We'll do that one first, though. F f with less lesser southern development. The south isn't without its charms, and maybe we can give it a few more charms, perhaps, right? Let's take a look at our... Wow, Texas is doing really, really well. Not bad. Uh, the NCR and the Legion have not killed themselves yet, which is totally fine. I feel like the weaker partner in this whole thing. Then again, they're going to have a lot of things to deal with. 9,000 manpower, we got more manpower. They have way more divisions. Industry, they have 81 factories, roughly double hours, so it's not good. Hit and run, not bad. Let's grab that. Have a good time with that. Build, 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 build. Equipment-wise, we're looking actually really good, except for planes. Which is going to be an issue. Oof. But we do have more than enough radios. And we're making some mobile fortifications, which we will throw on our divisions as well when we get there. Actually, for you guys, we might want to use some uh, logistic companies, or at least expand our road network. That'll be good. Uh, for this campaign, I think we'll just stick with some basic ballistics. Basic ballistics. How about that? The BB. The basic ballistics. Tepic is done. Oh, wow. Okay, so, Edger Cito Mexicano, um, obviously, you know, I'm just going to do this one off-screen, real quick. And here we have it, with the division of provinces, we shall say. I gave Texas and the Unity of Austin what I thought they probably deserved. Ooh, Plasma Weaponry Schematics, nice. Pulse Code Modifications, nice. That actually is really, really cool that we got Plasma Steam Rifles 660 days ahead of time, but, you know, we'll get there eventually, hopefully. But yeah, not too bad. I like the way this looks. Let's see, for us, though... 
So we're looking pretty good. At least the Jungle Pack does. But to win a war, General Gabriel often wondered why he ever accepted such a title. If he had been told 20 years ago that he, the reward for slowly advancing through the military ranks of Atslan was spending long nights staring at maps and reports, well, the prospect of becoming a career officer would have been far less convincing. The only thing salvaging his mood was the contents of the various reports scattered across his desk. It seemed that if only for the time being. Itza was on the back foot. La Fuerza had held their own against the ICDEB and even scored against some operational victories. Or scored some operational victories. <clears throat> the consistent intelligence failures of the Atslan had painted Fraga for years. Or painted it, pained him. He never felt like he could lead his troops with confidence and always afraid of its on ambushes or surprise offenses until now. He'd been fumbling in the dark against an enemy he seemed to know nothing about. If just maybe that could change, well then this would be a whole different war. Atslan turns over new leaf. Cool, another division. Let's stop training and get ready to go to war and not call any of our allies in. Give me about five seconds. Good. Five. Four. Good enough. I'm not going to call anyone else. Oh, and they're going to attack us like a little bit like crazy. That's fine. Actually, you guys could probably do pretty well there by yourselves. Or at least that was what it looks like. Oh, now you're not. Well, okay then. Go and hold yourselves. Hold yourselves in at night. If you guys could do well there, maybe, maybe not. And no. And eh, they're going to attack us for a while. That's fine. I don't really care. Uh, build up two air bases there. It'll be fine for us. Nope, not going to call any other people in. I might call in or fight Moctezuma, maybe. But yeah, I gave the Chichen Itza this part of Texas, or this part, just because eh, I figured Texas, Texas shouldn't get this part of Mexico. It doesn't make any sense. So, and I don't deserve any of it, so the only other person to give it to was the Chichen Itza, so it is what it is. Oh, don't tell me. It's, oh, this is glitched. Oh, crap. That sucks. Um, Before we go any further, how, how much strength do these guys have? 2,000? We'll see about that. 58 divisions in total. That's not too bad. At least our soldiers right now are getting at least some army XP, which is pretty nice, I would say. Lesser develop, uh, lesser southern developments. As a show of Raphael's quality's kindness, we can send charity to aid the huddled masses. Another civilian workshop and a 60% bonus, two of them, for civilian technology, industrial technology. Jonathan Griffin, welcome aboard, Jonathan Griffin. Welcome, welcome aboard. Yeah, they're attacking like a bunch of crazies, which is totally okay with me. I'm totally okay with that. Because after this, Houston Rockets were annexed. I remember the old days when the Houston Rockets actually had a focus tree. <sighs> How sad. Who's leading this guy? Is it the... Chobang. Chobang. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's try some of this then. And anything else? Consumer goods technology? Might as well, right? Defensive armaments are nice. Land auctions coming along. Improve our special forces. Say no. And not bad. All right, let's take a look at compliance. We are about 96% down here, which is pretty darn good. Oh, man, we're going to need 300 political power for this one. But that's 82,000 people. That's nuts. That's a whole lot of people that we don't that we could use in our military. Uh, for now, Pueblo City is fine. We do need to increase the supply around here, of course. Let's put that on there, too, which won't work, apparently. So, whatever. Planes, we're still lacking a few, but it looks like we're maybe making a few of them as well. Fortifications, we'll get them done and put them on our special forces as well, which would be quite bueno. And now the Vice Royalty has 61 divisions, but no manpower. Actually, let's take a look at Stockpile. How are they doing with Stockpile? They got some anti-tank rifles, a little bit of dynamite. Anything else interesting? They are out of infantry equipment. Nice. It's got some, got some tribal scout kits. They've got some support equipment. Not too bad. Let them waste themselves on the line again and again and again and again. Well, either we will finish them off or someone else will also go to war with them and kill them off as well. Which is totally fine with me. Ooh, they are even getting some attrition down here too, which is pretty darn nice to see, I would say. In the meantime, what are we do doing? We're building some more civilian factories, which is nice. No, thank you. I wish I could see this. How many men have we lost? Uh, 1,600. That's not too bad. For what we're doing here, that's like nothing. Actually, how much people are we making? Well, 70 people a month. That's not great. Not bad. Any other upgrades? Not really yet. And the focus. Uh, the Chilpancingo trade expeditions. The merchants of Chilpancingo are eager for new markets. Let's help them find some. Another industrial bonus. Nice. Uh, very good. Very good. Just keep doing what we're doing and we'll do relatively okay. I don't think we can yet see their conscription level, which really does quite suck. 61 divisions, of course. These guys are 18 combat width with anti-tank, huh? And they have 10 combat width with quite a bit more support equipment. That's okay. Hit and run. Let's go with walking tanks. Nice. Some more divisions. Sure, thank you. Oh, actually. There you go. Uh, if you want to trade places, I guess that's okay. Uh, they're looking a little weak over there, which I do like quite a bit. 
War equipment is, of course, nice. Common weaponry, yes, please. Yes, please. Now, trying to attack anywhere is going to be a pain in the butt. It's not going to go very well. It's probably going to be pretty darn bloody. Could you guys actually win here? 42, 43, 44. If we force the attack, we might just be able to squeak that out a little bit. Maybe. Especially if we've got all that air damage going along. Platoon training is not bad. What if we grab some division recovery rate? Or infantry recovery rate, really? Can we bust through the line? We might just be able to. Gabriel Fraga is doing a pretty good job, even though we are getting attacked as well. Uh, that's a case. I'm going to have you hold, but you're going to support the attack because I don't want to get encircled here. Uh, any using anyone else to fight over the river is probably not a really good idea. Go on, continue forcing the attack. If we're fast enough and beat these soldiers up quick enough, come on, come on. We broke over the river. Now that is awesome. And let them settle themselves. Maybe, maybe not. Have you guys go that way, probably, actually. Ranger Doctrine, very good. Let's grab some aquatic combat training. Very, very nice. Get over here so we can cut all these guys off. Scavengers Triumph, nice. Even more in industry training. Oh, my goodness, we actually encircled them. If that's the case, uh, they probably have... Poor, yeah, they do have some ports over here. Keep our guys in place. Defend like, like bananas. Which, I'm not sure where that expression came from, but... You know what? Let it exist. We literally have a single division there. Wow. Um, that's the case. You guys just... You guys could take out El Foro and actually get some support and free up these guys over here. That might not be a bad thing to do. We could use more infantry, more special forces divisions, even though these guys are 20 combat width. These guys will get fire bases, even though we can't really support them yet. For, oh, yeah, maybe we can, actually. Yeah, why not? There you go. Beautiful. Now, you can't lose here, guys. That's a big, the biggest no-no we have here. Very nice. Alright, the Urapan City State. If we honor the city's traditional privileges, perhaps we can promote further economic growth. Why not? And can we demand territories? I don't care about the organization stuff. Um. Betran? We can try it. Why not? Oh! Hello! They just gave it to us! Holy crud! Seriously, they just. Okay! Oh my goodness, there's a lot of resistance over there. Uh, for now, free fighters, we're just going to eradicate all that then? We did 10% compliance, not bad, not bad. Ooh, we actually took the capital. Holy crap. We're doing quite well. I love it. Awareness. Because we all have recon on these guys, so that's good. Beautiful. Well, you you say you're done, but you're not really done. I love special forces, man. Special forces are muy bueno, as they might say in Mexico. Or muy bueno. Probably muy bueno, not muy bueno. <laughs> that's too American. Alright, so we got divisions on the line. That is beautiful. Actually, if you go to war with these guys, we'll just launch an invasion from this side. Oh, boy, we're lacking some stuff here, aren't we? Oh, yeah, that was probably pretty bad for them, actually. That was pretty darn bad uh, for these guys, the Vice Royalty. Well, let's go ahead and have a good time, shall we? And you're going to force the attack, because we are ready to just push into them now. Hopefully. Complete, utter, front-line pusherinos. Kind of disappointed to get that much more manpower from coring uh, Okza? Oz Ozaka? Ozaka. I think it was Ozaka. Isn't that a water bottle company? Ozaka? Or something like that? Ozarks. I know that one. Nope. We're going to do this by ourselves. Let's take a look. Destroy that organization, son. Destroy it. Beautiful. I just wish we could see how much uh, stuff we have there. Good. And, oh, and they're done. Now, I might have lied a little bit regarding what we would want from Yahoo. But that is okay. Because we should be able to cut down all the resistance around here. It'd be better to invade them, get rid of them, throw some more soldiers over here as well, as we plan a few extra dude arenos right here. As you can tell, I'm not really not interested in fighting... Klaloks, little kitties. Alright, now. I just want them to defend. That's all I want them to do for now. Oh, hello. What is this? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold the phone. <sighs> what do we got? Oh, Moctezuma. Moctezuma. What are you up to, my boy? Well, y'all can go there, then. Actually, yeah, no, yeah. Why not? You guys do that. 
Quite a few divisions over there. All right. And then one, two, three, four, five. You couldn't have shown me earlier that you're going to try to kill me off, huh? I'll see how it be. Two, three, four. There's a few more infantry divisions, not gonna lie. Uh, do all the rest of these then, that's fine. There you go. And then you guys go right there. There we go. Perfect. No issues whatsoever, and then the Houses of Trade. The Merchant Houses of Urapan offer whatever your heart desires, no matter how jaded your appetite. Beautiful. Zochical goes looking pretty darn good. And we can use more military factories. But then again, we're just conquering more military factories. Don't forget, don't forget, Mr. Mocha Lover. You gotta put in them doggerinos. That's right. You know what? We're gonna put in some recon because it helps with even mole suppression. Even though I don't know if we'll actually be able to afford that. But hey, whatever. How much longer until these doodorinos go to war with us? I, keep sh I should stop saying doodorinos. Crush the Atlan? No, no, no. I think it'll be us who crush the evil, corruptible Moctezuma. Oh, good. Walking tanks. Let's grab some. It's just not that ahead of time, which is totally fine with me. Engineering skin, okay. Uh, rapid prototyping, shall we? Oh, look at this. Zochicalco. Another upgrade? Yes, level 8. Very good. Costa Caffinata. Pacification. Oh, wait. I don't want to do that. I want to do... Wow, that's quite a bit. Riders. We should have enough equipment for that, right? Yes. That's good. That is some good stuff. Nice. Basic drills are pretty good, too, probably. Mechanized training, because we can. Excuse me. I had a sneeze. So far, I'd say we've been probably, at least in my opinion, the most successful I've been in this campaign so far. They've gone to war with us. Let them try to touch us, and then we'll swat their hands away and say, Ew, your hands are disgusting, sir. Leave us alone. No means no. Until we want to invest or, you know, raid you. So, it is what it is. We might get being up there a little bit in the north a little bit, but let's grab some more soft attack for our special forces, which should do relatively okay. Uh, grab one division, come up here, because it looks like they're hurting just a wee bit. Can you guys actually force yourself over there? Yeah, you might just be able to, so we can cut off all these guys up here. If we cut these guys over around or up here, that would be devastating to these guys. Holy cow. Okay, never mind, we are doing it. Holy crud. You guys keep these people in play. Bad words. One, two, three, four. Four plus two is usually six, eight, twelve. 12 plus 4 is usually 16, 20, I'm going to assume 30, because I'm not going to do how many divisions that is. So, okay, well, we just basically cut the entire army off, so let's go right in, <laughs> okay. Okay, yeah, why not? Screw it, why not? Look at all these guys. I'm not even going to read how many divisions this is. I'm sorry, I don't want to read right now, so. I don't want to add. Adding is for people who like to add. And my mind is not set to add right now. Still can't see that, Whatever. And a manor rifle territories, we could do that. We'll do that later. Nope, don't want to see that. Finalize reforms. Improve this stuff. More agency. Eh, let's just spend the caps. And another slot. Is that really worth it? I don't know about that. Let's grab some of this. More stability. I love stability, man. Stability is really, really bueno. Actually, how many divisions do they have right now before we kill them all off? 18,000 manpower, 68 divisions. And next we shall do... The labor lords of Puerto Valati. Valites. Place. The lords of Puerto Valates. Oh, they it's a typo there. Have kept their land intact through strife and blood. Let's entrench their power over their subjects. And get a whole three infrastructure in one place. Not bad. Not bad. Man, I just wanted to go to war with some other folk, and then you guys come over and say no. That is evil of all y'all. Yeah, time to kill them off then. Wow, this is really sad. This is really, really sad. Alright. Jesus Christ. And, boom. Uh, will we still be able to go to war with those guys in time? Maybe, maybe not. It's only 70 days, though. That's not too bad. We're going to go to war by November 20th, so we probably won't get there in time. So just in case, let's how about we go ahead and re-justify on them anyways. It's not like it takes that much time. 65 days, it's only 13 political power. Whatever. Whatever, whatever, whatever. And how many divisions they've left. I can't imagine it can't be more than 20. That's 28. So we killed off more than half of them. They started 68. Half of them would be 34, so... Yeah, not bad. How about any upgrades? No, kind of disappointing, but that's alright. 
Hopefully we get more military factories too. We're gonna rival the Itzenova there. For its ah. Not bad. We got plenty enough of those things for now. Uh strip power armor, we're gonna put those in our special forces, perhaps. Oh, we definitely need more of this too. Oh yeah, let's definitely get that going too. Rapid prototyping is nice. Do that too. Rapid prototyping, followed with advanced tularinos, and then basic infantry equipment with more land at attack, because we can. Eh, I can focus more on stability, why not? Massive expanded capabilities, we might do that too. We'll see what happens. No guarantees. Alright, are they doing last stand? No, it looks like, nope, they're not doing it anymore. For some reason, sometimes it just looks like it. I keep saying it, it they're doing it, but they're not, sometimes they're not. Oh, we need more infantry armor. Well, it would help if we actually made some. <laughs> Can't blame others when you got that going on. Yeah, level 9. Jeez, that's really nice. It's actually very, very, very nice. Oh, you don't need all 11 divisions doing that. There you go. Some one guy that way, too. Well, at least we had to go to war with them ourselves. He went to war with us, which is pretty nice, I'd say. Thank you very much for fulfilling what we needed. Uh, are we losing... Oh, uh, no, we have a little bit. We could get some more energy, though. The labor lords of Puerto Vallarta, uh, the plantations. By tying the masses to the land, we can exploit their wealth for the nobles and the state. Two more civilian workshops? Sign us up. Oh, the locks there is their capital, eh? Not for long. Oh, we cut them all off from the capital. Ah, very good. Very, very good. You guys, you're doing a great job. Just come on in. Just, just go on in. Nice. San Luis, ah, so many dead. So many deserve to die here. There's at least 20 divisions here, so. So sad, but not really. They deserve it. They all deserve it over there. Beautiful. Oh, they still have a few divisions. Oh, we got encircled ourselves, but doesn't really matter because he died. And we did it, and we killed them all ourselves. Not too bad, I'd say. Well, it's time to take out a drug cartel. Goodbye, El Bandito Sangriento. Because it's time to go ahead. Oh, and they immediately attack us. How oh, about we attack them too? Oh, this is still glitch, god dang it. But that's alright. It's alright, things happen. Oh, they immediately attack us and uh, they're pretty much losing. Which I think is a great, great thing. We can still use more planes, of course, but overall, let's hope the infantry do a good job up here and they don't suck too much. Actually, do they have any planes up? Oh, they don't have any air bases, which is a big no no in my book. Big old no no. Let's grab some bricks. And let's build up some of this up here. This is very glitchy. It doesn't seem to work sometimes for some reason. Uh, and we, we did become a spy master. So, very good. Very, very good. All right, national focus time. Let's grab noble supremacy. We have reformed a society to give all the wealth and power to the nobility at the expense of the middle and working classes that would support a strong speaker. Hooray! More construction speed, efficiency cap, research speed, a little bit less infrastructure construction speed, but hey, it is what it is. Actually, I didn't even chosen this stuff. Let's go ahead and grab more attack. Let's grab more attack. I want more piercing and more attack. There we go. That should help us solidify our win on these guys, which would be good. And let's help us, let's just start attacking down here too. Boy, boy, no. Good, good, good. And get another level two because he can. Now that should definitely help us out, right? Yeah, there we go. Night vision devices are very bueno. And we shall grab what else? Recon? Yes, please. More recon for us. Now, infantry, a little disappointing here. I wish you'd do a little bit more, but A, it is what it is. <clears throat> Special forces are just so good. Because we have so many bonuses to them, so. Matslan? That's literally our name. How have we not. Why do we even taken this yet? Also, I am just fighting against Zapata, so there is that too. Oh, what? Sorry, I, I don't like how this looks. I'm just going to give you... Maybe over here. Eh, I, I kind of prefer the old way. I don't know why you gave it up, so... That definitely looks a little better. At least in my opinion. Eh, I gave him this too. They don't have claims on it, though, but... Eh. Uh, meh. Meh. I make all sorts of noises. You guys go here, too. There you go. It doesn't really matter. Let's go in here, too. Logistics 1. Let's grab Logistics 2. Shall we? And then you guys, just in case, let's grab you once we have enough army XP. Uh, are we doing anything around here? Did you kill any, everyone off? No? Okay. Why did you leave? There's something right here. Third angle is what we wanted, man. Oh, hello. No, I'm pretty sure I know how to create an army. 
If I don't know how to create an army by now, after playing this game for literally like three years, uh, we've got a serious problem. So, yeah. Drop that strength. Drop them. And besides, we just gotta wait for some time to go to war with these guys. So it's gonna take a little bit of time. Oh, uh, yeah, we're gonna need some bigger armies for this then. Currently get 1.3 political power. Not bad. Noble supremacy is coming along. And then after this, we'll probably go ahead and do something else here. Oh, that's kind of nice. So we'll have to beat it on the right side. Not bad, not bad. There you go. Thank you. Cool. Alrighty. Put you... Oh, no. Good luck. You're going to definitely need it there, son. And then we'll put you right here as well, while we will have special forces down here too. Because these guys are going to be the ones that really try to push hard to the south. Probably missing more infantry. Oh, radios. We're actually missing radios, huh? Probably missing more infantry equipment. Oh, there goes the Legion. Part of the Legion. Um, well, not that much of the Legion. The Phoenix Republic is not looking too big, I'd say. Our gods, Th Harvey Thomas, huh? Well, they have generic focus trees, so I'm not sure why they exist, but whatever. These guys are probably pretty darn strong. Hmm. As long as all of our soldiers have anti-tank, that's probably for the best. Okay, you guys don't have anti-tank. Well, then maybe we should fix that. Oh, boy. There goes radios. we got more than enough anti-tank, though. Field surgery reduction, not bad. Let's go ahead. So we finished the two right sides. Let's go fish on the left side of the focus tree, then. Uh, let's grab the serpent's nest. An air force needs someone to take off. Let's clear a few peasant hovels to make room. Why not? Yeah, let's grab some of that. That'd be kind of nice. After recon, let's grab some grenade rifles for all of our divisions. That'd be pretty good as well, I'd say. There goes the Phoenix Republic, too. Still getting a good amount of daily army XP, so that's pretty nice. And let's train our soldiers just in case we need to. Y'all are doing probably fine. And after bricks. Resources are looking okay. We'll probably grab some industrial fertilizer. I think that'd be quite bu -bu -bu bueno. The Haber process. Oh, okay. Nice. Build, 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 build. Uh, build there and there. We're going to keep building stuff, but build some factories like that. And we'll build some of this, too. All this stuff. All this gloriousness stuff. Beautiful. Alright, almost done. And boom, 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 boom. Fighting through Mexico can be a real slog, but so far it's not been too bad yet. And I say that, it's going to be god-awful probably very soon. They got a lot of divisions, not going to lie. They got a ton of divisions. I might have to call in our allies, but let's try not to. Do we have any extra planes? Not too many more, but hey, we got a few. There you go. And let's go do this, too. And we'll throw you right here because you have more divisions. Not bad, not bad. Up to 46, that's not too bad. And we should be able to go to war pretty darn quickly, actually. Or pretty darn soon. 15 days, 2 weeks, that's not bad. Expand our capabilities. I'd like to actually core more stuff first, really. But we'll do that anyway since we're here. And then we'll finalize our forms. We got plenty of money. Pursuit. Oh, that sucks. We got enough money. Let's go and develop more stuff. Let's grab some of that because we want some of that, too. We got 111 caps, not too worried about that. Good, more divisions. Sign us up, please. Now to make us just slightly stronger. Yeah, we definitely need a lot more radios. Wow. Uh, does do the militia divisions need the radios too? Yeah, they do. How much rider equipment do we have? 2300. Quite a few dogs. Um, let's see. So we'll change you guys out with riders. That should be enough for them. Ooh, we might not have enough for all this, though. Yeah, we definitely won't have enough dogs. No, we have enough. That's good. And do the enforcers require radio? Yes, they do as well. But they have more suppression, so this is okay, then. All right, well, we'll see what happens with this. Can you guys actually win over here? You, you still might be... It. They're so strong. So strong. You also might be able to win over here. If we put enough pressure on them, this side might be able to win as well. You know, just everyone attack. Here, if an ambush, if you like to read about this, go right ahead. It is, it, okay, these guys are really bad word strong. Bad word strong. Additional intelligence reforms is not bad. Serpent's Nest. Lords of the Atsalani is great. It's, it's okay, actually. It's not super great, but it's, it's okay. Uh, Swiss Sauce, of course. The True Unity. 
Oh yeah, that hurts our infantry divisions. It is what it is. It definitely helps our special forces. Let's grab fortifying, fortifying the spires. If we can't control the skies, we can at least deny them to others. Which way you get more motorized, which doesn't make any sense to me, but whatever. Not bad. We're doing relatively okay. Uh, and we're doing everyone here just because we get all, the max amount of air damage, so. That's really why. Oh, and we cut these guys off. Alright, after this, let's go to war with Imperial Mexicano, shall we? Just because we can. Even though, I think we should have probably gotten a minister of one of these guys. Flower Child, just for World's Times. Yeah, we'll probably have to go for that one next instead of spending political power on other stuff, so. It's alright. It's alright, alright, alright. Electrical extraction, because we can, because why not? How does no one else have an upgrade yet? No? You guys, you guys don't like learning, do you? You really don't. This is still glitched. Sucks. Um, can you not pierce them? Yeah, you can pierce them. Hmm. Sucks. Sucks to be infantry. Oh, but you cut these guys off. That's pretty good. Beautiful. Oh, why did you go to war with them, dinguses? Why? Do you, do you, why do you have claims on this territory? Oh, my goodness. You're dumb, dumb. I'm not helping you in that war. No way. No way. No, you go kill yourself if you want to. That's not my problem. But what I would like to do is take back all of Mexico if possible, including the NCR-held territories as well as the Legion-held territories, so we'll see about that. No, you got yourself into that mess. I'm not bothering you to do it. If you take out Texas, great. I just can't be bothered to help you out, son. Grenade rifles are nice. Let's come over here and do some of this. Let's go on in. Let's bet you take these folks, so. There you go. And let's do this, too. Flower child, good. A uh, Fragarino Granados. And there you go. There you go. Stick it to them. Torreon, very nice. And Imperial Mexicano is next, which would be very, very nice. Interrogation techniques. Not bad, not bad. How are they not dead yet? Hmm. Oh well. Are we missing infantry equipment? Whoa! It's always the radios, man. Never have enough radios. Logistics 3. Let's grab Logistics 4 because we can. Oh, there's a reason why. We just made a bunch of special forces. Not bad, my friends. Not bad. Let's come over here. Uh, Let's not do that. I hate being in the same ally alliance as these guys. Oof. Hate it. It's a little annoying. And if we take Monterey, though, we get another um, thingamabob. And by thingamabob, I really mean trade node. Actually, they, how many trade nodes do they have down here? Let's, let's take a look at trade nodes real quick, since we're waiting anyways. Uh, let's see... Ozaka? Go trading maintenance. Right, stab already El Foro. Well, that's quite a bit of money already. That's nice. Yeah, they only have one, which is fine. Let's grab some foxhole doctrines. You guys, let's throw you right there. Nice. Train anyways, because we can't... Oh, finally someone has an upgrade. Let's see. Anything... Interesting, unique, different. We have that one. We could get Cunning Leader for more max planning. Or Tough Leader. I like Tough Leader. Experience soldier losses. Then we'll go for that one. Nope. And then we shall do... Rise of the Coalt Cult. In pre-war mythology or role-playing bugs, we can't quite tell. Flying shipments known as Coalt control the skies. Let us honor them and their initiative. Very nice. Scavenger turn triumphant. Great. The stupid pit boys, too. So how much longer will it take? Hopefully not too much longer. Eh, we'll wait a little bit longer, just to see what happens. Because I do want to see what happens with these guys. I don't know why he decided to go to war with Texas. Like, of all places, of all nations... Okay, maybe that's okay. Wait, why did they go to war with those guys when they're not even war with those guys over there? Uh, oh, wow, we're doing a lot better on radios now. 94 factories, not bad. Not bad at all. Do we need more doggos? Radios... Fire teams of all things. Actually, we need more fire teams, huh? Alright, whatever. We can make it some monoplane attackers, which is very, very nice. Instead of just a field marshal, no one else, and no one else. And that's okay. In addition, how about we throw on one thing there, and then eventually we've got to take out the Sinaloa Cartel next episode, as well as the other giants. We'll build stuff right there. And don't forget to build up our infrastructure. Wow, we need so many radars or radios. Holy cow. 
Uh, do reinforcements high as well. Upgrades can wait. This is good to wait for as well. It's fine. Yeah. Hopefully we can see this. West Louisiana, huh? Electrical extractions, nice. Uh, where is it? Roller girl war. Roller girl war. Wow. See that times fat. Five times fast. I can hardly really speak at the time of me recording this. Apparently, though. So, I better not try. Land auction. Uh, I think we're more about principle, right? Jack war. Uh, Lifebringer, Banner of the Flayed Man, Wasp, Legacy of the Lost, Cult Supremacy. Ooh, maybe I'll leave it, leave it up to you guys. Should we do principle or should we do purity? I'll leave it up to you guys, even though I personally think we should do maybe a little bit more of... Maybe purity, but I'll, I'll leave this decision up to you guys. So, Since we're getting closer to the end of the episode anyway, so... Let's take out these guys and then we'll call it a, an episode. Not a campaign, because tomorrow will be the final end part of the campaign, which we take out the big boys up north. Actually, since we got you guys here too, anyways. There you go. That should be slightly helpful, right? After that, even more recon, because, well, we love recon. Or at least I love recon too much. And eh, let's grab some, re some rocket launchers. We all love some things that go boom. How much manpower do you have? It's a... Don't make me take out Texas, too. 13,000. Oh, they're actually running out of manpower, too. So, uh, they might do okay, maybe. Maybe not. We definitely have to wait and see, but, hmm. Alright, so, about three weeks left. That's not too bad. Demand our rifle territories. We can do that later. I guess we could finalize our forms, so... There you go. 70 days left. Do some of that. Help out some settlements. I spend political power like it's candy. Holy cow. Oh, logistics is nice. Let's grab some better recon, finally. Maybe we'll grab some air doctrine. Maybe we'll grab some naval doctrine. We'll see what happens. Anything else? Anything? We can't actually choose anyone here, so... We don't actually own Mexico City, which sucks. Jaguar forms pursuit. They said, we said that's the last time. Next time we'll be prepared, and we weren't. So that sucks. Fortified states, though. Or estates. We understand that nobles must protect, their the, uh, must protect themselves and their subjects, which is very, very true. Oh, and they went to war anyways, huh? Well, I'm not going to go to war until I go to war them by myself, though. So. I'm not joining them. Nope, 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 nope. 89% stability ain't too bad, but we're gonna lower that very soon by going to war ourselves. And we get another agent here, huh? Frank Andrews, thank you very much. And maybe we should stop training as well. And Pedro Mexicano, you've made a big ol' mistake, Arino. Let's go right on in. They won't be able to stop us. Special Forces, do your thing. Oh, you've. Oh, you're just attacking. There's literally nothing in front of us. I did not join the war. I did not join their war. I will not fight Texas for you, man. I swear, I will not fight Texas for you. There you go. Beat them up, them robots. Go straight for Monterey. Cut all these guys off, which isn't actually too many, which is fine with me. More radars, more equipment, equipment, equipment. Uh, that's fine. Let's see, anywhere else, build it there, and then build some there. Obviously, I don't really care about the Navy too much, so. Oh, look, we cut them off. Nice, good job, guys. Good job, Arenos. I don't know why I keep saying that. Maybe it's because I like it. Not bad. Not bad. Hopefully we can move quickly enough through here. Come on, guys. Take him out. Shouldn't be too hard. Hmm. Hold on, hold on. Let's take a look. Oh, they're dead anyway, so. Would well, you look at that? Their strength is not dropping. Well, their strength is dropping, but their organization is not. They do last stand all the time. But unfortunately for Tristan, it's actually, or more fortunately for them, I'm going to take all the states because I think we deserve it. But that's going to conclude today's episode. Tomorrow we will go to war with the Sinaloa Cartel. 
and the entire Legion, and probably the NCR as well, depending on who survives. But regardless, hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow when we have a great time finishing out this rest of the campaign. Thanks for watching, have a great rest of your day.